Town of Edisto Beach is working on beach repair plans after last week's storm. The impacts from Edalia left some problems that just can't be fixed overnight. Meredith Blair is live on Edisto, and Meredith, certain parts of that beach have significant erosion to the dunes. Yes, Rob, you can see some of that erosion directly behind me. Now, for reference, I'm about 5 feet 10 inches, so I'm definitely on the taller side for a woman, and you can see that behind me that it is much taller than I am, hence that erosion caused by Tropical Storm Adalia. Now, I spoke with someone who lives just a couple houses down, a resident here, and she's having to use a ladder, actually, to get on and off of her beachfront access. She says before the storm, her drop-off was more around 2 to 3 feet, but now she's looking at about 4 to five feet where her house is. Now the mayor of Edisto Beach told me today that they're working with DHEC to get emergency permitting for these beach repairs. And then we'll bring a company in, going to take bids on bringing the company in to push sand, what they call scraping. They'll scrape sand from the beach front back up to build that thing back up to uh, put protection back in front of those properties. Moore tells me that he expects the bids to come in for this permitting in the next week or so, and that will lay out a timeline for when they can expect to get these beach repairs underway. I'll have the full story tonight at 7 o'clock, and we'll hear from that resident I just mentioned. Live on Edisto Beach, Meredith Blair, Live 5 News.